Hi, my name is Courtney Ryan and I took an incredible pack of and go trip in June of 2018. I booked the trip as soon as I found out about the company on Facebook. Uh, I was so excited about it. I brought it to my husband and I was like, let's do this for your birthday. He was ecstatic as well. We both love anything that's spontaneous like that. So we just couldn't wait for it to be there. And I think we had a month in between the time that we booked it and the time that we left for the trip. That month was so fun and excruciating and <laughs> trying to just wanting to go immediately and trying to figure out where we were going from all of our clues and our emails that we received. When we filled out the survey, it was really fun. There's so many questions on the survey about um, where you've been recently so you're not sent there again, or um, where you're planning to travel you know, in the future so that you're not sent there either. So it was fun to fill that out. And then they ask a bunch about the interest and in things on the survey. And I'm pretty sure we checked off almost every single interest. We were just so excited. And I um, wrote in another section that we were just up for anything. You could send us anything anywhere and we would absolutely love it. So we could not wait. We got the envelope about four days before our trip started. That was difficult. I was on the verge of handing my envelope to someone else outside of my household just to hold on to it because I just knew I was gonna spoil the surprise and open it for us, but I held out, we did it. We opened our envelope the morning that we arrived at the airport. It was really fun. We had someone film us opening our envelope and we opened it to see that we were going to Chicago. That was honestly just such an incredible part of the trip. I recommend everyone wait to open your envelope as late as humanly possible because it was so much fun going through security checkpoints and things like that that aren't normally a fun part of the trip and just thinking 20 minutes ago we had no idea where we we're going and we we're about to get on an airplane <laughs> so that was so fun uh, while we were on the plane we pulled out all of our envelope materials and I had a highlighter with me and we were going through and highlighting all the different things that we knew we would want to do while we were in Chicago we were looking at all the things that Pack and Go provided for us so we were sent to the Kempton Gray in Chicago absolutely beautiful hotel. I recommend it if you're planning your own trip to Chicago. And then we also included in our package was a list of recommendations for lots of things that we could um, do ourselves. And then we also had tickets to the um, art museum in Chicago. And we also had tickets to Sky Deck in Chicago. And if you've ever seen that before, it is so cool. You stand on this glass box platform and just overlook Chicago. We have the cutest pictures from that. I, um, I'm i so excited that we got to do that. Once we arrived at our hotel, we immediately knew that we wanted to go to our first dinner reservation that was reserved for us. So we started getting ready and we went to our dinner and that was so incredible, just trying different things. And then I had a friend who had been following along on my Instagram stories and said, hey, I just recently went to Chicago. You have to go to this place that has incredible milkshakes. So it was so fun that we had so many friends and family that were involved in the trip as well that they were so excited to see where we went and wanted to make sure that we had an incredible time on our trip as well. The next day we got up and we went and found um, Cloudgate, which is the bean in Chicago. It was so fun to take our pictures in the reflection. And I also had a friend who we hadn't seen each other in about five years. And because of my stories on Instagram, she found out that we were also in Chicago at the same time. And we randomly got to meet up there and take pictures together. And that was just a really cool experience to neither one of us knew that we were gonna be there at the same time. So that was really neat. In our packet, it was recommended to us that we could rent bikes and ride them around the city. And we love riding bikes, so we went ahead and did that. We rode them all the way from the area around our hotel over to Lake Michigan and brought our swimsuits. And even though it's June, Lake Michigan is freezing, but we did swim and it was so fun to see that little beach area and everybody just hanging out on their boats or on the sand. One of our favorite parts about Chicago was the incredible food that we kept eating everywhere we went. Chicago is of course known for their deep dish pizza. We had to try that. We went to Giordano's and got the quintessential picture of pulling up the pizza and having the cheese droop down off of it. So that was really fun. And then um, we went and got some Portillo's hot dogs as well. You just have to do those things when you're in a city that they're known for. So that was really fun. The food was probably one of my favorite parts. We um, also, with our recommendation, decided that the day before we left, 
to go to the airport, we had a little bit of time. So we filled that time by going to the Field Museum and just exploring. That wasn't something that was pre-booked for us, but it was something that was recommended. So that was a lot of fun to be able to just fill our time with the different things that are um, important when you take a trip to Chicago. I loved how easy it was to get around. We, um, in our envelope, there was a sheet of paper that showed us all of the amazing transportation options that we had in Chicago. So we, it was so easy for us to use Ubers towards those places that were a little bit further. The trip itself was absolutely incredible, but the time leading up to the trip was so amazing too. We loved getting our weather forecast a week before our trip, and then we got an updated forecast the day before as well. So that kind of helped us pack, but it also helped us guess. We were sharing it with friends and family. Everybody was trying to see where we were going. Um, it was just the best time, honestly. We're so excited to take another trip soon. The next trip type we sign up for is gonna be an outdoors trip.